It's recording. Cool. Yay! Oh my god, I'm back. <laughs> Excuse me. El Musica. <laughs> I'm back, finally. What's it been like? Three months? Three? Trace? Trace? Months? Oh, I don't know. Oh, I finally got a camera! But it's not like an actual like video camera. <laughs> it's more like you can take pictures, but it's a YouTube capture mode. Yeah! Yeah, there's... A lot of stuff has happened, hasn't it? Twilight movie was released. I think that's really it for that area. And New Moon being announced, and Eclipse being announced. Hopefully, no Breaking Dawn. I didn't say that, man. I swear I didn't say that, okay? I didn't say it. That was the imaginary twin that was just here. <laughs> Anyways, um, and. Mortal Instruments news. <laughs> uh, cookies that I don't want to discuss because I discuss them enough on the forums that are dying peacefully <laughs> and haven't really been widely used since October because the people in the podcast haven't gone on in ages. I'm not going to say their names because I probably hunt them down even though they all live on like the other coast because I can't remember what coast this is right now I'm thinking it's west coast but I'm not a geography type of person I keep thinking this is like really weird maybe that would work oh yeah 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 that works sure why not whatever you say man <laughs> I like talking I guess I don't know. yeah um yeah, not really exciting news. Oh, probably this doesn't matter, but there was an art contest. ARC. Advanced Reader Copy Contest for COG that I didn't enter because I didn't feel like going through pictures and whatnot. And I have a new setup here called my room because since I have a mobile camera now instead of a little crappy ass webcam that got me in trouble yeah so I guess it's personal time yeah you just chill I'm just chill I'm acting like I'm completely drunk right now but I'm not okay oh yeah I keep touching my hair don't I oh I have a new hair color from black to like punk rock red I don't even know if you can see it because it likes changing color in the light yeah Nothing really exciting. I finally talked to my Canada friend. She just subscribed to me too. I was so happy. I'm like looking for Alaska. It's you, my love. It's you. It's you. And I've been busy, so I have an excuse not to be updating stuff. I have an excuse. Okay? I've had school. In school. And driving stuff in school. And yeah, a lot of stuff, man. That stuff. I just got like 20 billion iTunes cards and I just spent all that money. $2.51 out of $75. I plan stuff a lot. Uh huh. Fascinating. A remote. Because that camera is put on my new iHome that actually works now. Uh, I have a lot of stuff. If you live in the US, go to Hot Topic. They have. A thing that I think smells like yummina. I don't remember. I remember. Th I don't know if there's something in Twilight about Bella smelling like this, but I think it is how she smelled, and it smells quite yummyful. Yummyful. <laughs> yummyful. It smells quite yummyful. It's, it's shaped like an apple, of course. It says the forbidden fruit tastes the sweetest. In Eighty mils milliliters which is uh 2.7 fluid ounces and it's 80 percent alcohol so you could drink it i don't think you'd want to do that though but eh, i don't know if you'd want to buy it either 
most teenagers don't have a lot of money and it's for like 48 bucks but then again if you can spend money on clothes i think you can spend money on a little thing of perfume you want to see what it looks like i'm guessing because the box isn't that fascinating i saw it online last night i'm like i should get this and i go in the store i'm like oh my god it's here see look it's an apple see it's an apple it smells really yummy they need to admit smell a vision it smells really yummy it looks like a cute little apple. It's a little top. You know, huh? Huh? Yeah. I hope this is recording correctly. Or else I'm gonna cry. It's bad if I cry. Cause then I get people yelling at me to stop crying. <laughs> is that right? Yeah, that's right. That's how I close something, right? Yeah, so 48, if you have a spare change of 48 bucks, you can get that lovely thing. Um. I guess since I'm on that topic of Twilight, I like the movie. I know some people weren't really disappointed by it, because he didn't really sparkle, he just glittered. You realize, glitter is hard to get off in a day's time, when they were shooting all the sunny stuff. Glitter is hard to get off. I know. I had some bad experiences with glitter, and you're never going to see them, unless you know me. And you probably see him every day. But, yeah. I liked it. I thought Robert looked really cute in it. <laughs> but who really did unless you're not a fan of him? That was the most reason, like, people went to see it, right? Because he was in it. it. Whatever. But I wish there was more cafeteria scenes. You know, like, where he's, like, ditching class is healthy. In the blood typing lab. Oh, no fair. That was, like, my favorite class scene. And some people did take the comedy of it all because he put his hand over his mouth like he was going to gag. It's like, well, gee, I wonder why he did that. Hmm, homicidal, like, vampire practically he wants to kill her. My voice is cracking, isn't it? I can sense these things. Basic life, whatnot, situation. It was still really good camp content really hot. Oh god, his abs are, his abs are pretty good. I love Victoria too. I would so, she's like, she's now an idol. Rochelle, I think I said her name right. She is now an idol. And who else? Carlisle. <laughs> Peter Delancey. Hi. <laughs> it's like, hi doctor, can you help me? <laughs> I seem to have an injury. Oopsie. Can you heal me? <laughs> Give me a private session. <laughs> I wish there was more Esme. I, I know I just, I think I said her name wrong just now, but whatever. <gasps> I wanted more of her. Like, with the little scene in the kitchen was really cute with the Italian cooking. Because uh, I ripped my Italian pride there. I was like screaming, Go Italian, let's go! Well, I was screaming internally, I should say. So I was screaming out loud. I, I, that's a bad person right there. Oh, yeah, that's another thing that bothered me about the movie. All the screaming little tweens. Okay, excuse me, I'm 16? What? 16? There were like 10 year olds there before me, and I get out of school at 3.15. What time do these little teenagers get out? Like, 2? How are they there that early? Did they, like, bribe their parents to get them out of school? I bet they did. We want to find out, don't we? Yeah. But I liked it. It was, it was, it was good for a book adapt, adapt, adaption, adaption, adaption. Yes, it was good for a book adaption, but it could have been better. It's all. It always could be better. There's only one situation where it will never be better, and that's The Dark Knight. That was just perfectness right there. That's just. That's pretty much movie in perfection. Heath Ledger better win that Oscar, or else I'm gonna go kill Hollywood. Yeah. He, rap, pride. Pride for the Joker and pride for Heath Ledger, man. Simple. It's simple. But yeah, I like the movie. <laughs> I keep saying that, but I really shouldn't keep saying that. And the whole new moon situation with Taylor possibly being replaced, it has me sad. Very sad, cause Taylor's fine. He's he has the attitude of him. He's built like 19 pounds of muscle. If you've seen any interviews with MTV, he's built like 19 pounds, and it looks like he's gotten a lot bigger. And 
the director changing. I have mixed issues with that. I mean, yes, I would prefer a female director because, like, you can capture the emotion easier. But we got Chris White, I think his name is. Chris White's, yeah, I think that's it. He directed the cold.